Okay, so this is a thoracic uh, rotation exercise. So here in the office, we're finding a lot of people have issues with being able to rotate sufficiently through their mid-back, which is where your ribs attach. So basically, um, what we call the thoracic spine. It's an area of the spine that's designed to be very mobile with rotation and leaning or lateral flexion. And uh, uh, Matt here has an issue with uh, rotation, more specifically to the left side. So we notice that if we improve rotation in the mid-back, we can get some improvement in low back and hip function. So in this case, let's just start for a, a baseline here. First thing you want to do, you're going to put your interlocker hands just like this behind your head. And you want to do it in such a way that you're not pulling your head down, but you're kind of able to stay nice and neutral with your spine. Okay, so this is a good position for here. So I'm just going to have him rotate as far as he can to the left just to see how far he can go. And from my angle, we're looking at about 45 degrees of rotation just off baseline. Okay. Now to start the exercise, and this is something you want to, to want to do prior to lifting or prior to core or working out, just so you can increase the mobility in the thoracic spine. Um, even doing this a couple times throughout the day would be good. Now the exercise goes as this. So he's going to rotate as far as he can to the left because he's limited in left rotation. Then we're going to have him lean to that point, just lean a little bit, and he's going to hold it for five seconds. And then he's going to unlean, bring it back to neutral, but keep the rotation. And then he's going to add a little bit more rotation. And then lean. One, two, three, four, five, back to neutral. And then he can rotate a little bit more and then lean. So you're sort of tricking the muscles to let go to increase rotation in the thoracic spine and then rotate one more, and neutral, okay? And then go and relax, okay? Now interlock your hands again, mm -hmm. and then rotate. And then, so from my perspective, he's got 60, 70 degrees now of rotation, so we've increased quite a bit um, just by tricking the muscles. So again, this is something you wanna do prior to working out. You're gonna do three sets of rotating as far as you can, leaning, holding the lean while you're rotating for five seconds, bringing it back to neutral, but not unrotating or derotating, and then doing a little bit more. Okay, so you're gonna do that, three steps of that. All right, and that's it.